What you're about to see is an actual fed up delivery in process. Hey, what are you doing out there? I'm waiting to deliver this package to you. What package? I didn't order any package. Three and a half weeks ago, this box was put in my truck and I'm supposed to deliver it. Three weeks? You call that service? Do you know how hard it is to keep track of a package in my truck for three weeks? I don't care what your problems are. I'm fed up with... You're fed up? I'm the one who was knocking on your door last week and you didn't answer. With customers like you who don't want the package they ordered. Then when I lose them, it's my fault. I want my package. Look, don't change your tone of voice. I'm putting your package back in the truck. Are you going to get the groceries? Are you going back to sleep or are you going to leave? I'll go. Are you going today or tomorrow? I'm going. Oh, it's okay. Don't forget the formula. Alright. I watched my grandfather for years in ministry. Uh, I first started singing at my grandfather's church. We had a concert at the church, and they were asking everybody, who wants to lead a song, who wants to lead a song? When it came time to rehearse, I opened my mouth, and everybody was like, you know, like where did this voice come from? And then my grandfather still didn't know that I knew how to sing until the day of the concert. One of my favorite worship songs Hey, it's Len Hauser with 95.5 The Fish, and today we welcome Kayla Johnson, Marketing Manager with Bright Peak Financial in studio. Kayla, welcome. Thanks for having me. Good to have you here. Tell us about And just the fact that I came here and, and my faith was built, I was able to see myself doing these things and God and just, I got a vision, you know, and I'm just glad I'm running with it and I'm running with it because of this ministry and the way that my relationship with God has been built now. And I'm just excited. I can see it. I believe it. I know God is just going to do something great. And I just, I'm excited to be a part of everything that God is doing. First off, I want to thank God for sending this ministry, House of Healing, to the city of Valeria. I came to this experience of House of Healing through the outreach of my, my minister, Martise Johnson. I still remember when I was first heard the call of God about the city of Valeria. I was actually getting my hair cut. Um, by my barber and um, as I was listening to the barber talk about how so many brothers were just lacking purpose, lacking direction and just without jobs and just just depressed. It, it really spoke to me and I really began to just seek God about what is it that I could do and that's when I went home and I began to talk to my wife and I began to pray about what is it that God was saying and what is it that he wanted to do through us. And that's when we begin to move forward with the vision that God placed in our heart. And that was to build a ministry where we would reach the unchurched, where we would reach people who wasn't attracted to the traditional church. And so that's when God really began to make sense of this. And so since day one, our vision for this ministry has been simple. And that's to heal the world one life at a time. Our strategy for that vision has always been to make the